Okay, I'm doing a quick video, or quick as I can, on the Resun Auto Feeder AF 2009D. It's a um, eBay purchased uh, feeder for about 20 Australian dollars. Uh, looks like it'll do the job. The tricky thing is how to um, set it up, at least setting up timers. You'll need to assemble the little mount, uh, which is pretty should be pretty simple. You'll need to put the feeder together. So the, the feeder just pops on there. There's a little keyway on the shaft. And you'll need to put the batteries in. Make sure you put them the right polarity. So there's a um, little plus on the bottom so the dimple comes out. And there. And then it's there. So I'll just run the motor so you'll see it spin. Okay, so and that's pretty much how it works. There's a little little adjustment there for the feed that adjusts how it scoops. So the tricky thing for us at least was how to get the um, get the timer set properly. So like any digital watch, there's always multiple buttons, but um, in this case, um, the, the, the important thing to realize is when the little colon in the middle is flashing, you know you're in the clock mode, so either showing the clock or for setting the clock. So as you move um, amongst different modes, and I might just have to tilt that forward to get the light um, into the, into the uh, display. But at the top of the display, you'll see the little digit moving from one, two, three, four, and that's for the timers. Okay, so um, so what we want to do, we want to be in the uh, the flashing colon mode, which is the clock mode. And to set that, to set any mode, you need to start with a set and you end with the set. Right, so we're going to set the clock, and uh, we'll just we press the set. So it's flashing the hours. We just adjust it. So now it's about um, what? What's the time now? It's just gone nine o'clock. So that's twenty-one two. Twenty-one oh two. So we just go. We, we're so we've got twenty-one. So we're finished with the hours hour mode. We'll uh, press. I'm pressing mode. So that's the mode button on the left, and now we've set the uh, set the minutes. So I just adjust that, press one. So now we're at twenty-one oh two. So once we're finished, so in clock mode, there's only two things to set: hours and minutes. Press set, and we're we're happy with uh, the time. And then you then can move to your different modes with the with the different timers. So again, one, two, three, four. And, and then if you you can see that the colon isn't flashing, so we know that we're in a timer mode. And then uh, once the colon flashes, this is the current clock time. So it's 21.02 on the clock. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set timer 1 for uh, 21.04. So again, uh, I need to press mode once and showing the timer, timer 1 setting. Okay. And... And then I'll press set to start commencing setting. So, so we just press adjust until I get to 21. Press mode. Press adjust again. And uh, I think we'll set it for 2104. Right, press mode again. And you can probably just make out at the top that the one is flashing which at the moment there is no rotation so we need to press adjust again and so there's one rotation and then I press um, two and there'll be two rotations but let's just set it for one rotation for the moment so one arrow down and once we're happy we press set so now we've got um, timer one set for 2104 so if I press mode timer two isn't set Three is not set, no arrows. Four, no arrows. And then back to the beginning, we can see that the current time is 21.03 with the colon flashing, and there you go. And so it, it just uh, operated at 21.04.
and because there's only a single one with the arrow down we know that we only have one timer set and so that's pretty much it how to set it uh, if you ever want to clear a timer for instance you might have had two timers for whatever reason and then you've got less fish then again go to the to the mode that you want to adjust so um, in this case we've only got the one one mode sorry the reflection for some reason there okay so we go back three four that's flashing colon so it'll be the time that's now in timer one with just the one arrow uh, we press set we don't want to change the time at all so we just go to the minutes now we're going to one with the number of rotations I'll just press adjust two rotations now there's no rotations set now um, there press set and that's all done so if we go again into clock mode and you can see there are no digits showing there so it's all empty so that that's pretty much it um, and it just 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 a reminder again so again now we might want to set it for nine o'clock in the morning which is a, a good time um, we'll change from clock mode to timer mode press set adjust the time to nine um, press mode we can adjust the minutes I'm sure the fish don't really mind if we're we're five minutes late but we'll just adjust at one for uh, 9.05 uh, press mode again and then now we again we want to have that one rotation that's it and we're done that's it I well, hope you enjoy enjoyed, uh, using your, your uh, resun fish feeder